Knock knock. Who's there? Cheese. Cheese who? For cheese, a jolly good fellow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill myself. Why should you put your New Year calendar in the freezer to start off New Year in a cool way? Ah, this is awful. Ah. Happy New Year, everybody. Hope you're doing great. Whether you had a bad year or a good year, I think we all can use a laugh. And I really hope that this year is better than the last one. So I found some New Year's jokes on the site called Good Housekeeping. This article is by Hannah Gion and Cameron Jenkins. So let's see if they'll make us laugh. What do you tell someone you didn't see on New Year's Eve? I haven't seen you for a year. Class. My dad gave up smoking cold turkey for New Year's. He's doing better now, but he's still coughing up feathers. Well... Okay, whatever. Why do you need a jeweler on New Year's Eve to ring in the new year? I mean, these are all like, I love dad jokes, but these are just terrible. Let's go to the next one. What's Dr. Frankenstein's New Year's resolution? To make new friends. Okay, this one is okay. I can tell this to my kid and they would probably have a giggle or at least. What do snowmen like to do on New Year's Eve? Chill out. Dad joke, but... A terrible dash hook. <laughs> Last year, I was able to keep all of my New Year's resolution tucked away in a journal on my bookshelf. I think this is more relatable than it is funny, but yeah. What do you call someone who says they know all the words to Auld Lang Syne? A liar. <laughs> okay, okay, this one is completely true. I don't think anybody knows. I, I, I know the chorus of it, but that's about it. What did the chef make for his New Year's dinner? New Year's filet. I don't even get this one. Maybe I'm stupid. New Year's filet. Filet. I don't know. I mean, English is not my native language, so maybe there is a pun there that I don't understand, but... Okay. I made a New Year's resolution to drink more water. So far, I've gotten as far as drink more. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I understand it, but it's a terrible joke. These jokes are just terrible. I need a good one. Ten. Youth is when you're allowed to stay up late on New Year's Eve. Middle age is when you're forced to. Again, this is not a joke. This is actually <laughs> the truth. This is happening to me kind of nowadays. I just want to sit at home, maybe watch some movie, bring popcorn, snacks, and that's about it. I don't want too much interaction with anybody whatsoever. What New Year's resolution should a basketball player never make? To travel more. Okay, understand it. Not very funny. Did you hear about the guy who started fixing breakfast at midnight on December 31st? He wanted to make New Year's toast. Dad joke. Pun. It's okay. Not terrible, not great, but it's okay. Why did the man sprinkle sugar on his pillow on New Year's Eve? He wanted to start the year with sweet dreams. Th this is just awful. Th I, I think that I can make up a joke in a second better than this. Oh, this is just... Ooh, this is... Hurting me how bad it is. My resolution was to read more, so I put the subtitles on my TV. Okay. Okay. This was like, like, a, like a small giggle. Knock, knock. Who's there? Radio. Radio who? Radio not. It's a new year. Oh my god. I can't even believe that I laughed even just a bit on, on this. This is just... I mean, it's, it's, it's okay. It's okay. When we compare it to the rest of these jokes, this one is incredible. This one is the best so far. What should people never eat on New Year's Eve? Firecrackers. Because they're crackers. Ah, oh, firecrackers. Ah. Oh. Very funny. In what year did Christmas Day and New Year's Day fall in the same year? Every year. Wow, that's a shocker. Oh my god, I, ca I can't believe I didn't know that. Wow. What's the one group that hates New Year's Day? The New Year's Eve cleanup crew. <laughs> okay, this one is, again, maybe not that funny, but it's true. Who would want to clean up all those plastic cups and bottles and just junk everywhere from firecrackers to anything? You know, it, it's always a mess. I definitely feel sympathy for these guys, but I am very thankful to each and every one of them for their service. Knock, knock. Who's there? Cheese. Cheese who? For cheese, a jolly good fellow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill myself. This is, this is awful. Oh my god, who made this? This is the worst list I've ever seen. This new year, I resolve to be less awesome since that is really the only thing I do in excess. I, I'm trying to find a person who finds these jokes legitimately funny. This is just stupid. Like, most of these jokes are not even puns or not even dad jokes. They're just... 
I don't know. That's just awful. I can't even think that kids would laugh at this. What did a cat say on New Year's Eve? Meow. Meow. <laughs> what else would the cat say? What did the dog say? Woof. Like, what? Why do birds fly south for New Year's Eve? It's too far to walk. I guess the only thing that's funny about these jokes is how incredibly bad they are. That's like, that's the only reason why I even giggle a bit. Not to brag, but I already have a date for New Year's Eve. It's December 31st. Because it's a date, you know, December 31st. If you didn't understand it, it he, he meant date format, like December 31st. He would also be correct if he said 31st of December. Still a date, you know. Just, just com to, to be completely, oh my god. My New Year's resolution is to stop procrastinating, but I'll wait until tomorrow to start. Wow, never heard that one before. New Year, I just got used to the last one. What can I say? That happens every year. I promise not to make any bad jokes for the rest of the year. Honestly, it's, it's not going very well for you guys. A dad on New Year's Eve. I'm a dad. And yes, I make terrible dad jokes, but honestly, I make dad jokes that are funny. These dad jokes are just terrible. They're not even that clever. Most of them you've heard, and it's, it's just like, I don't know, first grade humor. And not even that. It's, it's worse than that. What do you call always wanting a date for New Year's Eve? Social security. Ha, ha, ha. Ha. I'm so glad that this year started with so much laughter. It's going to be so positive. I can't wait. Why should you put your New Year calendar in the freezer to start off New Year in a cool way? Ah, this is awful. Ah, oh, I don't, I'm not sure if I will be able to continue reading all of these. What does a ghost say on January 1st? Happy Boo Year. I need to find a gun somewhere. Oh my god, these are terrible. What's the problem with jogging on New Year's Eve? The ice falls out of your drinks. I mean, okay. This was like an okay joke, but not even worth a laugh. I love when they drop the ball in Times Square. It's a nice reminder of what I did all year. It's not my fault if your whole life is a mistake. It was a mistake doing this article. People who wrote this, I'm sorry, but you probably deserve to be fired. This is awful. Knock, knock. Who's there? Abby. Abby who? Abby New Year. Is there anything sharp around me so I can just stab myself? I want to cut out my eyes. This is hurting my brain. I'm going to make it through this list, right? Okay, that's my New Year's resolution. I'm, I'm, I'm going to try to do this. My New Year's resolution is to be more optimistic by keeping my cup half full with either rum, vodka, or whiskey. Okay. Not funny, but a solid idea. Why not? What is Corin's favorite holiday? New Year's Day. Next. What's a cow's favorite holiday? Moo Year's Day. Oh my god, this, is, this one is even better. I was going to quit all my bad habits for the year, but then I remembered that nobody likes a quitter. Wow, such a deep sentence. So good. This is like... This is inspirational. At the beginning of this year, I made a New Year's resolution to lose 10 pounds. Only 15 more to go. What is a New Year's resolution? Something that goes in one year and out the other. Again, not funny, mostly true, and what can you do? I hope you guys don't make New Year's resolution. Because making too much New Year's resolutions usually ends up bad. Instead, I want you to make a small goal, something small that you can do each day, but that will have a snowball effect through the whole year. That's my wish for you. Don't overthink and don't do too many stuff because you're probably just gonna leave your resolutions like everybody does. What's the best New Year's resolution? It's a uh, 1080p. That's not even true. Like it's, it's probably 4k or even bigger than that. My New Year's resolution is to break my New Year's resolution. That way I succeed at something. Good for you. Make your goals so small and so stupid that you don't feel completely shit about yourself. What happened to the man who shoplifted a calendar on New Year's Eve? He got 12 months. Why is this a New Year's joke? Like 
whenever he shoplifts a calendar, he's going to get 12 months. Like, is it any special because it's on New Year's Eve? Oh my God, these jokes. They're not even jokes. An iPhone and a firework were arrested on New Year's Eve. One was charged and the other was let off. Incredible. This one, this, I gotta say, this one is probably the best so far. I told you a lot about the other ones. What did the little champagne bottle call his father? Pop! <laughs> this one is actually cute. What did the little champagne bottle call his father? Pop! <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going crazy because all of these were so bad that this one is this one is almost good. Oh my god. <laughs> Where can you find comedians on New Year's Eve? Waiting for the punchline. And just like that, <laughs> that little positive moment that I had is gone. <laughs> Every New Year's Eve, I look forward to the good show at Times Square. And year after year, they drop the ball. Honestly. So many people get disappointed there, waiting for something, and they just drop the ball. Oh my god. Awful. Awful. I hope Times Square can get a hold of themselves. Let's celebrate New Year's Eve by making many poor decisions. Like, I'm only hoping that poor is a pun here, like pouring alcohol or something, because if it's only like poor decisions, I, 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 this is, these guys need to get fired. I would lose weight for my New Year's resolution, but I hate losing. Good for you. Amazing stuff. What do you call someone named Steven on December 31st? New Year's Steve. <laughs> I give up. This is awful. I, like, please leave good jokes in the comment section because I will need some rehabilitation after this. I hope this one is better. Why was six afraid of nine on New Year's Eve? Because nine, eight, seven, <laughs> six. This one was probably in the top three jokes out of all this list. The rest were so bad. I mean, not, not to say that this one was good. It's awful. <laughs> but at least it has some momentum. It has rhythm. Oh my God. Who gets the most excited about the New Year's Eve countdown? Calendar companies. Why? Because they have to work once a year to do something. Like, I'm, I'm guessing they're making a calendar... It doesn't take too much time. If you really want to make a great calendar, let's say it even takes up a full month of your work. What do you do with the rest 11 months? Probably write stupid jokes online. What do New Year's Parade have in common with Santa Claus? No one is ever awake to see them. I mean, okay, but not funny. The, it's, it's not a joke. It's just stupid. Dracula passed out at midnight on New Year's Eve. There was a countdown. <laughs> Okay, this one was kind of good, kind of kind of okay, but that just tells you how bad the other jokes were. Now, I'm going to do a countdown to end this video. 3, 2, 